The following is a planned C-section on a French Bulldog female. After the patient was clipped and prepped, an incision was made in the ventral midline of the abdomen. First through the skin, then through the subcutaneous or fat layer, and then finally down to the abdominal wall itself. Once the abdominal wall was reached, a small stab incision is made with the scalpel blade, and then a pair of scissors are used to extend the incision through the abdominal wall, revealing the internal organs. In this case, you can see fat on the right, and then just to the left of that bulge is the uterus itself. The uterus is then exteriorized, first the right horn, and then the left horn. Can you see how many puppies may be in this litter based off of what you're seeing on the uterus itself? Once the uterus is exteriorized, then a scalpel blade is once again used to make an incision in the body of the uterus. That excision will be continued with a pair of scissors. Once we get through, you can see the yellow is the first puppy that is now being visible. That puppy is grasped and removed from the uterus. The first thing that is done is that a pair of scissors are used to break through the placenta and remove the placenta from around the puppy and especially the face. Once the puppy is out, then we will take and tie off the umbilical cord. And once the umbilical cord is tied off, it'll be cut. The puppy appears motionless right now because it's sleepy. The anesthetic agent that was used to sedate the mother uh, also gets into the bloodstream. The puppy is passed off to a technician who will stimulate it and get it revived. This procedure is continued exactly the same way with the second puppy. As you can see, we're grasping the second puppy, and that's the head of the second puppy that you can see right there. And once again, a pair of scissors will be used to make a little incision through the placenta in order to remove the placenta from around the puppy's head and face and body. This procedure is continued exactly the same way of tying off the umbilicus, presenting it to a staff member having them take and revive the puppy. Once all the puppies are removed, the uterus will then be closed. The uterus is closed. And then the uterus is placed back into the abdominal cavity. The incision is closed first the belly wall, then the subcutaneous tissue, and finally the skin. Once all the puppies or the mother has been is in recovery, the puppies are placed onto the mother in order to start nursing and receive colostrum and milk. In this litter, as you can see, if you guessed five puppies, you would be correct. A special thank you to Maya's Mini Supremes for allowing us to share this moment with you.